Hey everyone, my name is Gamer Corey, and welcome back to another Red Dead Online video. Now, in this video, I am going to be going over one of the day's daily challenges, and uh, that is going to be cooked succulent seasoned fish. Now, you might be asking yourself, what is succulent fish? And uh, it would be steelhead trout is a good option. Now, in this location that I'm currently at, you guys, this right here along the Dakota River, pretty much from about. Uh, Limpany here, this little abandoned town right here, burnt downtown, all the way down to Bard's Crossing area, is really loaded with steelhead trout. Now, there are other areas. If you guys want to go down to, say, Thieves Landing area, and right along this bridge area, there is um, steelhead trout as well. So you can kind of go with one of those two different options. Those are probably the two easiest ones that I recommend. So definitely take advantage of it. But all you really need to do is go ahead and catch yourself just just one. Well, you're going to need a couple because we need to get three fish in general. So we're just going to go ahead and change our lure out. I'm going to go with the special river lure that attracts the steelhead, largemouth bass, and salmon pretty easily. And there's a lot of fish spawning here. I kind of waited until it was daylight. So I'm hoping that this kind of is all good for us right now. So I'm not really seeing any steelhead in there but we'll cast out this way and we'll kind of see what happens so let's see all we need is really just to catch one steelhead trout and then all we need to do is break that trout down by going into our satchel and then also just uh just, just breaking it down from there so once we go ahead and catch ourselves a steelhead trout then I will show you guys exactly what we need to do. There we go. I thought it was going to be a little bit longer than that. So now we just need to do, play a little bit of fishing game here. And back and forth and reeling in at the same time. Come on, fishy, fishy. Feels like my line's going to break. There we go. We got our first steelhead trout. So all we need to do is make sure that we keep this fish right here. And then when you guys go into your satchel, so we're just going to go ahead and put this away. We don't need the fishing pole right now. We'll catch our other two fish here in just a moment. And then we just have to open up our satchel real quick and then go on over to where our fish is located. All right, there it is, guys. It was under the ingredients towards the very bottom, our succulent fish. So each steelhead trout that you get, you're going to get one of these. And then all you need to do is make your way on over to any of the campfires. There's actually one in Valentine. This is the reason why I recommend this one right here is because it's not that far away. This location right here, that's not that far away from Valentine. And then you just need to use either mint, oregano, or thyme seasoning, and then cook that, and then you're going to get that daily challenge all done and complete so i'm gonna catch two more just real quickly and then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go up to valentine and season those in just a moment all right guys so i am headed on into valentine if you come to this location right here where this little camp is at uh i'm not really sure what kind of camp but it really is there's sometimes there's npcs in here and sometimes there's not we just need to cook or craft at this campfire right here and then what we're gonna do is whenever it decides to load for us we're gonna go ahead and go down to our succulent fish and then we're just gonna season it with whatever we have so I have oregano here so I'm just gonna go ahead and cook that and we just need to cook the three succulent fish or the steelhead trout and then we're gonna achieve our daily challenge so that is going to be one complete and then we're gonna go ahead and cook another it doesn't take very long to cook them thank goodness for that so this is number two right here. Then we just got to stow that again. And then we just got to cook one more. It's the last one that we have in our inventory. And then we got our point four and our 200 experience points. And obviously you guys might get more or less gold depending on where you guys are currently at for your daily challenges. But that is all that I have for in today's video. If you guys did enjoy this video, finding out exactly where to get the succulent fish and how to break it down and cook it, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It would help me out a lot and is greatly appreciated. But until next time, YouTube, you guys keep doing what you're doing because you're already doing it. And you guys stay gaming.